one is an opportunity for students, um, in this case from Western Sydney, to come together for two purposes. It's to learn more about the careers, um, the breadth, the opportunities that exist within our health sector. I'm here because I want to learn about the health industry and I'd love to be a nurse one day. And it's also for peer-led, um, peer-direct programs around health prevention. All the literature shows that if young people talk to other young people, they're more likely to influence change, especially when it comes to behaviour. Uh, we're here to experience. help, <laughs> yeah, to gain the experience, to just learn how to put our ideas into action and, yeah. you know, address some issues that we also think are relevant. Yeah. Yeah. We want our young people to be the leaders of the future and we need to empower them to be the advocates of key messages, especially in areas like prevention of e-cigarettes and vaping. Young people are the future and like they have to know what they're going to begin to start talking about and they know how to connect with the rest of the young generation and spread their voice. The students get to identify a health issue or concern of their choice and then they get to work together as a team with inputs from many different professionals over the couple of days so we get lots of different mentors in to help them along the way and then they get to present their campaigns um, to, a, to all of us and to their peers. They're our future workforce, they're also the the most powerful part of the community for, for really producing change and they're, they're so hungry for learning, they're so hungry for an understanding of what's going on in their world and they're keen to do things about it. It has been an amazing two days. This is the time where we need to get our young people to be the campaign directors for messages that are going out into their own school communities. Bye.